Hi friends! Today in Valentina's Corner we are making homemade pretzels. And if you've never made homemade pretzels, they are so much easier than you think. The outside of the pretzel is chewy, it's got that coarse salt on it, which you can obviously just leave out, and the inside is soft, and when you pull it apart and dip it into your favorite um, dipping sauce, it is an amazing recipe that you're gonna make with your family over and over again. In a bowl, combine one and a half cups warm water, three tablespoons unsalted butter that's melted, two and a fourth teaspoon active dry yeast, one tablespoon granulated sugar, and you're just going to want to whisk that and let the yeast activate for about five minutes. Meanwhile, measure out four cups all-purpose flour and sift it once you've already have it measured out and combine it with one and a half teaspoons of salt. Once the yeast has been activated and is foamy, you're going to want to create a well in the flour and pour the liquids in there. Add the dough hook attachment to your KitchenAid mixer and knead the dough until it is well incorporated. If you're doing this by hand, you just want to continue mixing it until the dough is elastic and the flour is well incorporated. You're going to want to cover the bowl with a kitchen towel or plastic wrap, whatever your preference is, and allow it to rise at um, room temperature for one hour. Lightly dust your working surface with flour, transfer the dough onto your working surface and divide it into 12 equal parts. myself a little assistant here. Kids love making this recipe, so be sure to have them join you in the fun. The pretzels aren't always as glamorous, but the, the memories are worth making. You're going to want to take each piece and roll it out into about a 20 inch rope. And then to create that beautiful pretzel shape, all you're going to need to do is um, create the rope into a U shape and twist the ends twice or once and then fold over creating a pretzel. And then you're gonna to wanna to repeat that with all 12 pretzels. In a large pot, you're going to want to add 8 cups of water and 1 third cup baking soda. Bring that to a boil. Once your water comes to a boil, using a large strainer spatula, you want to put 2-3 to three pretzels in the water bath for about 30 seconds. Remove the pretzels and add them to your prepared baking sheet. In a small bowl, whisk together the egg and 1 teaspoon water. Then brush the top of the pretzels with it. Sprinkle coarse salt over the pretzels, if you like salt, if not, you can totally leave it out. so much for joining us as we made these homemade pretzels. I hope you enjoy this recipe and love it as much as we do. Don't forget to hit the bell icon to be notified of future recipes and subscribe to our YouTube channel. Bye friends! Till next time!